was born branded for tragedy. God looked at me and gave me the bad touch. Dad had brown eyes, Mom had green. Hazel was stuck dangerously in between, and the Hazel devil stuck out when she wasn't with Dad. When he died, I was left, hazel eyes hiding behind heavy, bland brown hair, painfully normal. Yet, as all continued to remind me, I am the spitting image of my father. I lost my face when he died. I was a walking eulogy. My dirty fingernails and heavy eyes were not romantic or beautiful. Death hung from me with my father's face, like an oversized coat, dripping wet, ugly. Death is, to 12-year-olds, ugly. So little trembling girl blurted out sensor bars at any point so someone would recognize her again. Mm. I loved him, but I am not him. I am him. I am of him, not him. And here I stand, my dirty fingernails chewed off for all my fear of what the world does to little in-between girls with no one to hide behind. Here I stand, my, to my tombstone spine staying straight for once after carrying my father on my shoulders for three years. Protected a name that was already safe, shoulder to pain I had already lost myself in too many times. It has taken me three years. Three years to look in my mother and sister's green eyes and not be ashamed of my darkness. But this is my face. These are my anxious knees itching to shatter. These are my fingernail nubs. This body is an outlier, and I am done hiding. I sheared all my hair off. In my dreams, there are fields full of hatchets, full of wrongs done to me and by me. But this, this is a grave. And these fingernails are outlined in mud. And I'm sorry I have to keep burying you, Dad. There are times I need to remember who I am, where I came from, what I am. I'm sorry I have to keep burying you, Dad. I just need to see my old reflection sometimes, where my young heart went and never was strong enough to brave Hades and come back to me. I'm sorry I have to keep burying you, Dad. You just won't stay dead. I'm sorry I have to keep burying me, Dad. It's all I can do to stay alive.